start to control our breath, we control our mind. And as you get control of your mind, then you start to control your body. Welcome in. I'm Coach Eric Dannenberg here with Adidas and Exos at our headquarters in Phoenix, Arizona to talk to you about breathing and how you can optimize yourself for running and sprinting. Improving your breathing as a runner or sprinter will result in less fatigue and optimizing your mindset or your ability to get in the zone. Starting off regarding distance running and breathing, the first technique is just to start by bringing awareness to your breath. While you're out there on your run, can you slow your breath down, but maintain the same cadence, the same pace? That's improving your efficiency. Now, if you really wanna take it to the next level, it's gonna be nasal breathing only. And I want you to think of this. If I'm huffing and puffing and really out of breath, I'm really using my sympathetic system, I'm ramping myself up. But if I can just breathe in and out through my nose, nice and easily, I'm gonna calm my system down, get into that more rest and relax, parasympathetic state. We're gonna optimize blood flow, gonna help us shuttle more oxygen, and you'll find that if you can control your breath, you can control your mind, and then your body, that mind-body connection, gets elevated to another level. Optimizing performance is all about practice. This isn't gonna happen overnight. Maybe it's parts of your run that you're trying to be more aware of your breath and slow down the breathing so you can optimize your performance. Now let's talk about breathing in regards to sprinting. For the sprint, we're gonna talk about those short sprints, in particular, probably a 40 yard sprint. Think of that start as the hardest part. Just like the bottom of a squat, you're gonna have a lot of tension, it's the hardest part. We're gonna take a big breath in to brace. Power breath out. From there, I'm gonna to wanna to see that nice relaxed sprinter's cheeks, nice relaxed rhythm. Simply focus at the start with the power breath and then let the mind and body do their thing as you finish on through. So in summary, we wanna pay attention to the breath. Whether it's for distance running or sprinting, it is a huge factor to tapping into that mindset or that flow state and getting into the zone. Remember, it all starts with this and learning to control your breath will help control your mind, which will help optimize your body. I love that feeling of hitting a PR, a pain-free, effortless run. It's why I'm so passionate to share these techniques with you. So get out there, enjoy every breath, and enjoy becoming a better runner.